Hello Vike Paws lover. Today I will show you how to add a new outlet for your store. So, stay tuned with me. For new outlet, click on the add outlet button. Now, add your new outlet with all required information. Now let's see what this allowed IP field does. The allowed IP field is that the IPs you add to your outlet will only get access to this outlet. In other words, it filters the IP to give access to your users. Now, enable the status and click add button. Now, if you need to update the outlet, you can do so easily by clicking on the edit button. As you may know, Vitepaw supports multi-outlet as well as multi-counter. You can easily add multi-counters under one outlet. Now, give your counter name and counter number. If you want to update a counter, then click on edit icon. Similarly, if you want to delete the counter, then click on the delete icon. You can select any outlet as your main branch. But remember, the main branch can only be one outlet. When you select another outlet as the main branch, the previous main branch will no longer be the main branch. But as I said earlier, there can be only one main branch. If you want to search for any outlet, then you can search it very simply. From the search bar above, using properties you will find your outlet. And finally, if you want to delete an outlet, you can delete the outlet by clicking the delete button. But remember, as a result of outlet deletion, all the information you had under that outlet will be deleted. Your purchase history, your sales report and income history will all be deleted from that outlet. So be careful before deleting the outlet. Hope you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned with Vike Paws.